Hey everyone, this is Sloan, and today I'm going to show you how I made the beat for Hearts Cold and how I recorded my vocals slash got the effect that I have. So, we're going to start off with a simple guitar loop. Super pretty, simple. Before I get to vocals and stuff, uh, we got a shaker come in, snap, kick, and then halfway through the first verse, then my snare, other snare, comes in, like a rising snare, and then a hi-hat. Just keep it, keep it fresh, build up. Then I have a rise come in and get us ready for the drop. And so I will show you my settings for my serum saw. Here it is. I love serum. It's um, the SY Electro Y chords, and then I manipulated it a bit um, just based off of the original preset and just like switch some things around. I also have another serum synth. But this one is lower. This one sounds like this. A little lower. And then the other saw sounds like this. So both of them together sound just a little bit more full. Like that. And then I have a bass in there. And it sounds like this. There it is. And then I have a hat swishing topper in there just to keep it a little bouncy. Now I think I will take you through vocals. My first verse, I actually have um, one lead vocal, so it's this one. Not that many effects on my voice, just some waves, um, delay, reverb, and compression. Um, and then underneath that, I have a vocal stack of pretty much everything so and then together and then i have my pre-chorus vocals here and this is where it gets a little bit more fancy this is the regular and then we add the stack and then we have a lower octave and with this, I'm using, um, it's actually a free plugin. It's called Gralian, and I'm pitching it an octave down. Um, and then I have some delay, reverb, and uh, waves on there. Um, so that sounds like that together. And then I also have a higher octave, too. Most people wouldn't even hear this. But it just adds, like... A little bit more high end. Cool. Um, so we move on from here to the drop. And during the drop, I basically took elements of the pre chorus and chopped up the vocals. So you'll hear some familiar words, such as. And I pitched it up with Gralian. Um, like the other vocals. Then I have some low vocal chops like this. And got the same effects with that Gralian sound. As we go on, I have the next verse. So. And then stack. And harmonies on this one. And then we move on to the next pre-chorus. So everything here on the second pre-chorus is the same as the first, but then we add the harmony. Just a little touch. Then I add a shit ton of ad libs. And here I'm using a like telephone EQ um, phone filter notch. As the song goes on, as you can see, I add some more fills and stuff just to keep it interesting and add some ear candy. 
just adds a little flavor in the beat. <laughs> just stuff like that. So that's pretty much it on my end, and I'm going to pass it over to my awesome friend, Michael Green, who will talk about mixing and mastering. Hey folks, Michael Green, mix and mastering engineer for Sloan Schuyler's new single, Heart's Cold. Just here to talk a little bit about the inner workings today. Uh, the stems that Sloan sent me when I got them really sounded great. All I had to do was add a little bit of warmth, saturation, and oomph to it. And I used two pieces of gear to do that. The Handsome Audio Zulu, which is a passive tape emulation, one of my favorite pieces of gear, uh, can be used to add a little bit of analog saturation or warmth to a mix. Uh, but can get a little crazier too if you want to add some heavy distortion. And the other unit I used is the John Recording Custom Mix Bus Compressor I have here. I got from my buddy Sean over at Mercy Recording Company. Just a wonderful piece of gear. These two units together are really what gave Hearts Cold the shape of the mix. Yeah. 